Good morning, everyone. No one doubts that for any black woman, that happy emotion when she considers herself beautiful is important to feel. Perhaps that is why the hairstyle that black women wear is important. It does not matter if she uses a wig, extensions, or Afro hairstyles. In this video, we will talk about a question that many people have when talking about African-American women in the United States. We will try to find an answer to the following question. What are the reasons a black woman wears a wig on the most important day of her life? In this video, I will try to explain the 10 reasons behind this choice in which some black women hide their Afro textured hair or kinky hair using a straight hair wig. In this type of analysis, I will try to talk about all the excuses, reasoning, beliefs, unconscious motivations, suppressed desires, internalized fears, and deep emotions when a black woman decides not to show her Afro hair on the most important day of her life and chooses instead to wear a wig to feel pretty, accepted and praised by men. From my point of view, the number one reason is searching for social approval, personal validation, and feeling beautiful, but also as a mechanism to avoid the feeling of rejection of Afro hairstyles in a society which imposes the European beauty model, such as all nations colonized by European empires, especially the United States. In a post-slavery multiracial society like the United States, black women want to accept it or not. They are pressured to fulfill these ideas of beauty where the phenotypes of the white woman are the idea to follow. Perhaps that is why black women on the most important day of their lives may choose to wear a wig with straight hair. As a way to conform to the beauty standards imposed by the group that is in a position of power, in this case, we are talking about white people. For me, the reason number two is, without knowing much about the psychology of women, one of the great challenges that black women face is competition with other women in which the opinion, good or bad, is extremely important when assessing how beautiful she is in front of friends, but also a coworker. And let's not talk about social media. Some psychologists and couples counselors think that the opinion of the social group formed by friends have a greater impact on the woman's self-esteem than that produced by the opinions of a black man. Black men who need to please women in everything she wants, sometimes even lying to her. There is nothing worse than competition that exists between women to attract the attention of the man she likes but also to be considered by her friends as a beautiful woman. Let's talk now about reason number three, why black women wear wigs, when many say that European white women's hairstyles are what is trending now. When you look at the latest hairstyles, no one doubts that white women's hair is the center of attention. When you look at the latest clothing designs by the most important fashion houses in the world, which is designed taking into account the hair texture of European women. Many times, black women rationalize the use of straight or wavy wigs as a mechanism to be fashionable and attractive, according to the fashion trends of the moment. Many wigs with straight hair, their high cost from my point of view, it's not worth the thought of making this type of investment as a mechanism to create the illusion of beauty in black women just to satisfy the social expectations of female beauty. Right now, there is a trend in which many black women are showing their natural hair as a mechanism of racial acceptance. Why are few black women not enthusiastic about this type of trend? This lack of support for Afro natural hairstyles, which is the trend of the moment, within a group of black community that tell you that the trend of that moment is not the real reason why a black woman uses wavy wigs on the most important day of our life. It is something much deeper than many want to admit. Now, let's talk about reason number four, which is the pursuit of racial privilege in a multiracial nation like the United States. Knowing the history of America, we could come to the conclusion that the search for racial privilege is part of the collective conscience in black women. Maybe that's why African-American women mostly use wigs. Black Latina women 
have Afro hair straightening as a custom. Historically, in all post-slavery nations, especially when we talk about the United States, the lighter your skin is, the more privileges you have. The more you meet the European standards, especially using a straight hair wig or straightening Afro hair, as a black woman, you have the belief that more chance you have to be successful. This is where the use of straight or wavy wigs and why not the natural Afro hair straightening comes into play. The use of straight hair wigs by African American women and hair straightening by Latin black women are a simple strategy to gain access to racial privileges of those who occupy a high ranking position. There is an emotional reason, personal value, and low self-esteem, which is associated with black women. Let's talk about reason number five, which is personal insecurity as a black woman. In a multiracial nation, Afro hair is viewed as demeaning, vulgar, unethical, and ugly, a lower class style, but also not accepted in many Eurocentric minded societies as is the case in all post-slave nations, especially the United States. All those negative stereotypes associated with Afro hair, especially the natural kinky hair, it plays an important role in many Black women who must wear a straight hair wig or straighten their hair if they want to be accepted in a position where personal image is an important part of the presentation of the corporate image that the companies want to promote to the public. Personal insecurity of some Black women plays a fundamental role when presenting the best of themselves in front of the world, in which the looks, not intelligence, is the factor to consider. As a result of this personal insecurity of the Negroid phenotypes, where Afro hair now is the norm, many Black women try to fulfill the European beauty standards as a way to feel accepted by hiding their natural Afro hair. Now, let's talk about one of my favorites. Wigs and straightened hair is much easier to manage than natural kinky hair, which is reason number six, why some black women don't use natural hair. Anyone who has dealt with Afro hair comes to the conclusion that the texture of natural Afro hair requires much more care than straight hair and straightened hair. And... Let's not talk about the different hairstyles that can be used on natural Afro hair, which is limited compared to straight or wavy hair. But above all, the time and effort it takes to handle Afro textured hair or Afro kinky hair. Right now, where everything runs fast, black women don't have the time to manage their natural hair when it comes to trying to go to work, a party, a family reunion, and why not a job interview? Maybe that's why reason number six is one of my favorites. When you analyze the reasons why African-American women use wigs and hair extensions and Latin black women straighten Afro hair, especially the Afro hair of young black girls. For this, we will talk about reason number seven, which from my point of view is the feeling that you are pretty, but above all, that you are extremely beautiful. As a woman, there is no better feeling than looking in the mirror and feeling that emotion that you are an extremely attractive woman. You see that smile on your face. You enjoy that feeling of personal satisfaction and how beautiful you feel at that moment. It is a moment that for many can be unforgettable. When your insecurity as a woman disappears, because at that moment you consider yourself the most beautiful woman in the world. A good makeup that goes according to your personality and the type of clothes you wear. But especially when you use a white woman's wig, which has a hairstyle, which will make you look gorgeous and more. If you are a professional woman, where appearance is important to you. A type of look that makes you look like a sophisticated, confident, and modern woman. That kind of sensation is worth millions. Maybe... That's why African-American women, no matter what price of wig they use, pay the price with pleasure. Not so much because of the wig itself, but because of the emotion of feeling beautiful that it produces in the woman when she looks at herself in the mirror and everything fits according to plan. 
That feeling of internal happiness when a woman can see that she is extremely attractive, according to what is recommended by the fashion style and the trend of the moment. It is a difficult feeling to describe if you are a black woman, rejected for being ugly, a woman who for the first time feels like the princess in a fairy tale. Now, we will focus on reason number eight, which culture is responsible for this behavior of black women when they use a straight hair wig as a way to meet the beauty standards of the moment. No doubt that European beauty is the standards, which is part of American culture right now. Just look at the most famous figures in the United States. The hairstyle produced by the straight hair of these famous white celebrities is the model that is in trend. In a society like the United States, where the popularity of African-American female figures such as artists, actresses, political figures, singers, who use straight or wavy hair wigs, no one doubts the enormous influence that black women have in celebrity positions. Young women who follow their life, lifestyle, type of clothing, fashions that are in trend, but above all, the hairstyle that these famous figures are wearing. It is normal for girls to also use straight hair wigs. This is where the culture influence is important to understand. Why a black woman prefers to hide her Afro hair and show a straight hair wig trying to imitate European women. Many young African-American women, for whatever reason, wish to look like those black women who are considered a role model of beauty, black celebrities who all wear wigs of European women. We have to understand that black girls will follow the same steps to feel beautiful as the women they idolize. In all post-slavery society like the United States, cultural factors are what determine the models of beauty to follow. An American culture which idolizes the beauty of white women and penalizes the beauty of black women, especially Afro-textured hair or kinky hair. This is where the straight hair of white women and what is in trend, contrary to Afro hair which many African-American women cover it with a straight or wavy wig as a way to feel pretty. The truth is, the use of wigs and hair extensions is part of the culture of African-Americans in the United States. In the same way, the straightening of Afro hair is part of the culture of Black women in Latin America. When we talk about reason number nine, we have to talk about the negative feeling that causes being rejected to having natural Afro-textured hair or kinky hair. It is a reality that many Black women don't want to face or feel. This is where the social rejection of African hair in the United States, but also in many Latin American nations, is an element to consider when using a European straight hair wig as a way to avoid feeling rejected. In many societies with the past of slavery, where there is a huge social exclusion of Black women, the texture of Afro hair plus skin color are racial characteristics that negatively affect the self-esteem of black women. For some reason, African-American women in the United States see the texture of Afro hair as something that prevents them from achieving their goals, dreams, and aspirations as a woman, but also the feeling of acceptance. The only way a black woman has access to some jobs is by hiding her natural Afro hair. Many African-American women as a way to reduce this social exclusion, product of skin color and hair texture, trying to fill the parameters of social behavior, and which the use of natural Afro hair is prohibited or not accepted. The discrimination of Afro hair is a factor to understand when a black woman wears a straight hair wig or straightens her hair. Discrimination, which is still part of the collective consciousness of many black women in America, which negatively affects self-esteem. Now, let's talk about reason number 10, which is that black women wear a straight hair wig because men like it. For me, this conclusion is the product of seeing black men who prefer a white woman and think that straight hair and skin color is the reason for this choice. Many women don't understand that for men, a woman's hair is not the center of attention, but what she has between her two legs. Asking some black men on this subject, in which I asked the question, do black women look more beautiful with natural hair or with a straight hair wig? And the answers 
surprise me. When some told me that they never paid much attention to the hairstyle that the black woman wears, as long as the hair is well cared for. When a black man looks at a black woman, her physical beauty is a factor to consider. Because the most important thing for a black man, not how pretty the black woman is, but how attractive that woman is. It doesn't matter if she wears her natural hair or wear a wig. Many black women, as a mechanism of self-deception, create the idea that they are more attractive to the black man when they wear a wig. The truth is, black woman does not use a wig to attract a man. She uses a wig to feel more beautiful, accepted, but above all, to avoid the feeling of rejection that natural Afro hair may or may not produce in certain people. Ladies and gentlemen, if this kind of topic filled your expectations, please subscribe to this channel, but above all, write your comments about this work.